Hi guys and welcome back to Climbing Daily. On today's show we're here for Sassi and the people are climbing on walls. So we decided it's a good occasion to see which shoes they're wearing. We are in a tunnel and we found these two gentlemen who... Where are you from? Uh, Cuneo. I'm from near Cuneo, Saluzzo. What are you doing here at the festival? We are chilling. <laughs> and uh, which shoes did you bring with you to this event? Uh, Solution, La Sportiva and uh, Futura from La Sportiva. Are, those are a little bit different because this one uh, are uh, good in... Uh, uh, put, uh, putting the feet uh, on uh, small and tiny creams, uh, while uh, those ones are uh, good for uh, slabs and, uh, and the holes like that. Okay, awesome. You? I took my solutions and my squama, because uh, <laughs> even if they're really broken, I use them a lot and uh, I really like them, so I never stop using them. And uh, those are my first shoes, actually. And... Um, I really like them, but uh, the solutions are much better now. And I'm using these when my feet uh, fit uh, art. <laughs> so. Do you think you'll ever stop wearing those shoes? Never. Until, um, I'm never going to stop until they're going to be completely broken. And I'm, then I'm going to frame them on the wall. <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right. Thank you so much, guys. Hey, so I'm here with Erica, and I was just wondering which shoes you brought to the climbing festival. Well, I brought my to-go shoes, uh, the Scarpa Vapor, because I love them. They're comfortable, and I've been having them for years, so I just know that I can climb in them for the whole day. And then I actually rented this pair of uh, La Sportiva's shoes. They are. Squama. Squama, yeah. I, I heard of them, but I never tried them. Um, very happy with them. Uh, I think they're great for small, crimpy roots, and here everything was pretty much crimpy. So, yeah, I'm very happy. All right, and your other Scarpa ones. Yes. So how many times did you like resold them? Because they look very old. And yeah, see, yeah, like, yeah, they like, are. History in them. Exactly, yeah. I think I resold them three times by now. All right. So, yeah, but they. They're still pretty good and I think you can just keep old shoes and you'll find a way to use them. They're always useful and yeah, I like not to throw away my shoes. I think it's good. Yes, thank you so much. I'm here with Matteo yeah. and uh, you got some interesting shoes. What are they? Uh, these are uh, from Scarpa, an Italian brand, and uh, Instinct SR. They are really good, uh, even though they are like ruined because uh, you know I'm a poor guy, so it's it's really hard to buy <laughs> new shoes. <laughs> no, but uh, it's really good, and uh, I use them for uh, like bouldering, and I have other shoes for also Scarpa for uh, rope climbing, like lead climbing, and yeah, I think it's uh, I'm really satisfied from this product. So yeah. And why did you pick them? Uh, because there was a discount and <laughs> as I said, I look for discount and Scarpa makes really good deals. So yeah, that was like, and also I, I found that, uh, I mean, they suit my uh, foot very good. So yeah, I was just satisfied. So yeah, I think I'm going to keep using these uh, shoes uh, for, a, for a long time. Thank you so much. Yosha mentioned they were vegan. Yeah, they are vegan. That's uh, ah, yeah. That's why. Uh, <laughs> yeah, you're right. That was... that was a discount, and they were vegan because it's not from it's like not from animal skin, you know. So uh, they're just made of plastic. Because I'm vegan, and uh, yeah, you should be vegan too. He is vegan. <laughs> oh, you're vegan. Yeah. Nice yeah. man. <laughs> nice, really nice. <laughs> All right, so I'm here with Crystal, and uh, she has some La Sportiva shoes. Which model is it? Tony, which model is this? <laughs> I actually don't remember. I got it from a garage, a garage sample sale. These are the most comfortable ones that I have. So yeah, I bring them with me to go climb when it's outdoorsy, and I know I have to wear it for a long time. They're slightly less aggressive and then more comfortable to wear. Were they all right for the type of bouldering on on buildings? Uh, outdoor, maybe 
especially bouldering probably not because they're not aggressive enough and uh, I bought it exactly the same about my uh, as my shoe size yeah. so they're not as aggressive and as tight they I want them to be and they're starting to get old so the rubber is starting to teal off a little bit and it's not as sticky as there do you think you're gonna get them resold uh, I might I think I'm gonna go for new shoes Which model are you thinking about? Uh, I've tried, the, I rented the Futura today, the La Sportiva's Futura. I liked it, but the the shape doesn't fit my feet uh, perfectly. I've tried the 510s, uh, the 510 high angle. Right. I really like them, and then I think I'm going to go for those. <laughs> Guys, these uh, events are super safe. I just left my shoes and chalk bucket over there for like three hours. Come to these events. Right, so those were the shoes. Some interesting choices here and there. There is a link down below if you want to pick up anything from the Epic TV shop. In the meanwhile, um, stay chalky and cool. See you next time.